13. <sighs> 13th episode of the FIFA 19 World Story. I really need to write it down or keep track of it in my head because I'm so stupid. Anyway, it is another Monday morning, which means we have more squad battle rewards. So before we go further into this, guys, if you do like the video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, comment, and share for all the great stuff. But now let's get into this. Well, two. Oh, I think I s barely managed to stay in that. <sighs> <clears throat> so we have the Rodriguez guy now, we have a Prime Mix player pack, a, 50, a Premium Gold players pack and 11k. Alright, so we're going to keep him more up to oh, 5 put to players now, I believe. Uh, who's FC Jungle? Oh, are they like a band of some sort? Oh, they're just going on a full England side. Apart from Schmeichel and Bai. Oh, Alright then, so you're in the sorry. <sighs> uh, right, let's see what we have here. Mm. This is the pack I got Alexander in last week, so... we start with it again. No, I'm actually going to save it this time. Because this one's actually worse, I believe. Right, premium gold players pack, let's see what we can get. No walkout. Board. Oh, inform! Inform, who is it? German, center mid, Hoffman! The Gladbach man! Yay! He might have gotten that inform for his great performance in the career mode. Eh? Huh? I'm sorry. Anyone else in the pack? Zayic, okay, but that's a good, that's good though, an inform. Discard informs actually go for a lot because of the Hazard SBC! Oh. Well, uh, that's a buffer. I'll say that much. Alright, so that's good actually. At least we made some coins. Uh, send them to the club. And place you on transfer list. And yep. Alright. Primex player pack. I'll probably do a two rare player pack after this. Alright, let's see what we can get in this prime mixed player pack. It's not a walkout this time. Is it another board? No, well. Oh, is that Matt Ryan? Oh, Jesus Christ. At least we got an inform. We got an inform, that's something. Um, Argentinian League. I might tell. No, I'm sure you got to start in those league SPCs, by the way. Anything else? Pro League. 55 rate goalkeeper. Nope, goes for jack shit. Are they out now? Live. Oh, my God. I wait what the fleet this challenge for player effects up five up wait what wait 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 what 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 hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on what the fuck is this complete this challenge for a player pick of a set of five icons see rewards so oh my god so you need an you need an icon in order to get Yeah that shit why don't you just release them individually like you did last year? Oh there's only three that I really want there and that's Yero Katuso and Overmars. Oh. oh come on EA, seriously. What do you need again? Bronze team, silver team, gold team, eight rares, team league plus three what is this shit? What? You need an icon, 84, 85, and an 86 rated team. This is. What? It's repeatable, I just found out. If you didn't need a bloody icon. Now, I'm just gonna see this now. The lowest rated icon, I believe, was Jens Lehmann, and he was about 220k. Let's see how much the icons have boosted in price. That's probably why they did it, to boost the price of the icons. Oh no, 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 don't you do this to me. <gasps> oh my god! 
The cheapest icons, 400k! Boars, they are about 200 to 300k. Now, they're all 400k plus. EA, you're such greedy cunts, like. You could have just done what you did last year, released them, one, out of, like, all five of them as their own individual SBCs. No, you all had to stuff them into one single icon SBC, which would have been affordable if it actually didn't need an icon. Last year, for Yashin, you didn't need an icon. For Overmars, you didn't need an icon. And for JJ Okachi, you didn't need an icon. Maybe this year you would have needed Hiero if he had a single SBC. But this is ridiculous. All icons are now boosted up in price. This is just ridiculous. Obviously, I could still afford them, but... That's not the point. Like the, la the whole point of um, Icon SBCs last year was the player, the individual players got their own SBC with their own clubs, own requirements. And also, guys, you remember I got Hachi where you need Barcelona teams and I didn't need an icon for him. If I needed an icon for Hachi, I never would have been able to complete him. I never would have done him. I was really lucky to get Petit at the end of the year. I actually managed to get him because, remember guys, I did Deco and I managed to get it done around the very, very end of the year before, I believe it was before, uh, like an episode or two after the Road to ended last year. They've just ruined it. Like, if it was a bronze, silver, gold, 84 in form, 85 in form, and 86 in form, that would be perfectly fine. You just had to put an icon into it, yeah. You actually ruined it. Like, what the fuck? Guys, um, I know this is probably a short video, but that's because I did have stuff planned up to that icon thing came out, and I just want to have a bit of a discussion about that. Right, so EA, you did very, very, very well with a kid's icon to SBCs last year. Eight player having their own individual things, the best players obviously have icons, multiple icons, so many icons. But the fun about it was people like Overmars, people like Haji, people like Rui Costa did not need icons. You just need like you to get a few informs, few high rate players, and that's it. I know player picks are a huge thing now, but why do you have to include an icon in people like Atuso, who's 89 rated? An icon on its own will cost you now 470k. Before this SBC came out, before EA announced it, they were under 280, 250k even. You could get a prime Gattuso, a prime Gattuso, for about 600 to 700k. This SBC. It takes 450k on its own to get just the icon part. You still need to include an A4 rated squad with, with like what? You need to include a gold squad with three informed, an A4 rated squad with an inform, an A5 rated squad with an inform, and an A6 rated squad with an inform. That'll cost you uh, roughly, if you don't have the players, near 400, 500k. So you're paying an extra like 200, 300k. To get one of the icons that you want, that's not even icon. Why do people don't want the Katusos or the Yashins or the Hieros or the Jejo Kotches? Why do people want, like, an 88 Raul? You can get to him for that price. Like, yeah, seriously, people don't. Well, I can't speak for everyone, but I don't like this. And I say a lot of people don't like this. I even ask my friends, they say it's stupid. I want to leave your guys. I'm gonna put up a poll, and I would really this time more than all the rest. But actually, no, I like all you guys pulling on polls. But this is a very important one. Do you think this is a smart move by EA, or do you think it's a bad move? Honestly, I think it's a bad move because they're just trying to they're trying to get people to open more packs. I understand it's a business move, but like the whole point of Icon SBCs were you do them over time. They'd be there for the whole game. This is only out for 30 days. You'd have the whole game to go for it. I started doing Petit and I think January after Team of the Year. Then I got him by the end of FIFA. I won't be able to do that now because these Icon SBCs only last about a month. So guys, please leave in the poll up above. And um, yeah, the two choices have been yes, EA, this is a smart choice. Or, no, this is kind of ruined Icon SBCs. Well, not ruined, but like it's made it really difficult. Well, yeah, maybe it's because people had a lot of icons. But like, people have icons in general, a few icons in general now. So, guys, please leave in the poll up there. I'll probably get into one game just so we can have a bit of gameplay in this video. But please vote in the poll and leave, my thought leave your thoughts down in the comments. What do you think of these new Icon SBCs? Elegated from Division 5, but I managed to get my way back into it. And I'm pretty decent in my position right now in rank 3. So we're going up against the lads. Uh, that's a very nice Atletico Madrid. We're obviously going to go with our Oktoberfest K. 
And also guys, I might end up building a very, very good team. That's a very nice looking team. Ooh, maybe I can take uh, uh, advantage of that on the right back. Anyway, I might spend more coins because my friends were saying, what's the point of having 600k? You're not going to use it. I was going to save right on SPZ. Now unless I can't score back down to under 300k or like at least under 350. Anyway, let's get into this game. I gave away a penalty needlessly, needlessly. I gave away a penalty because I'm a tick bastard. I'm so fucked. Yep, damn it. I'm honestly the biggest dumbass on YouTube. Uh, no, okay. It was, it was where it go. You see, I thought I was going to block the shot, but I, I, I didn't. That's simple as that. I just didn't block the shot. Nice ball of parity. He's on. So is he. So is he. Why? Oh my god, Gwyneth! Oh my god! Why did you just turn down to your right? That's why I took the touch. Well, parity, someone. Oh, why didn't Gwedis take a touch on his left and hit it on his right? Oh, party. Oh, no. Oh, oh Usman. Oh, guess what, guess what? Can't touch this. Oh, guess what? Can't touch this. Can't touch this. Fuck it. Oh. I've gotten the fucking ball, I have the ball, and I'm gonna go with the ball and I'm gonna score a great goal if I can just at least get in his fucking box and get a decent shot off where the players use their correct foot. Ahem, Guedes, you fucking Egypt. Oh. Hey, guess what, guess what, guess what? Daniel Vass! Suck my nuts. See, I think he's actually my top goal scorer, Daniel Vass. Him and his fucking mad haircut. He looks like he got electrocuted. And yeah, lovely, lovely finish and we're back on level terms. A fierce night. Vass, Gamero, I don't know what I'm doing, I should have taken a touch. Oh. Damn, I thought Usman, oh, I thought Usman was going to go for a run, but he got fouled. Okay, quickly. Great parity for a pass. Nice. Never mind, that was fucking awful. Why is Langley? Langley is annoying me. He really is starting to annoy me. Like, he does good sometimes, and other times he's just a liability on the pitch. Like, there, he did well. But what happens if we'll him try past this? Okay, it worked. Gamero making a run. Burba spin. Pass it. Get past. Vass, once again. Gets the goal, and I think Gamero got his second assist as well. Oh, Jesus Christ, he turned the game around. But like I said, I don't know why he's my top goal scorer, even though I have Kevin Gamero. Oh, God. Boy, check Chesney, you're gonna pick that out now. We're trying to get, we're gonna get Vasa hat trick. I did, I did bad. Oh, my God, I did so bad with that pass. Okay. Who's my. Where's Semedo? Oh, there he is. What? Why is he? Why is he acting at centre back? No. Gardado. Oh, come on, come on, Guedes. Can you do something positive besides have fucking HIV? He's offside. Oh my God, he wasn't offside. Ah, shit. Oh, my poor lack of judgment. Oh, I'm gonna get kicked up the hole now. I'm gonna get kicked up the hole now. All because I thought Aguedes was offside. You're gonna, blow, you're, gonna, you're gonna blow the whistle, ref. Referee, it's three. Thank you. Thank you. You're gonna blow it as soon as I picked up the fucking ball. Right. Um, at least this half ends on a positive note. Um, yeah. We're 2 1 up thanks to two. Decently work goals from Daniel Vass. And why is this loading? So I'm going to get kicked down. I've got to get down. I've got to get down. Wait, what? What? Oh, he rage quit? What? He rage quit? Oh my god, the stats. Holy fuck. Um. Okay, guys, I'm very confused. Uh, I'm so confused. Why'd he quit? No, Oscar? 
Um, well, that was a lot shorter than I thought. Uh, I just clicked through. I wasn't looking. I was looking at my door for some reason. Um, well then, <laughs> that's the end of the episode. That came to a very uh, abrupt end, I guess. Oh, play a division rivals. What do I get? Let me get a bunch of coins on the sentinel. Uh, uh, you know what guys, I'll get uh, two of our player pack for you, I'll be back. Much for watching the video. If you did like it, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, comment below, share your friends all the words up. I also forgot guys, there's just one more thing I have to do before I uh, open this two rare player pack. Player of the Lone has it for 20 games, who looks absolutely unbelievable with those stats right there. He'll be on the bench, obviously, for now. I will try to use him if I do qualify for Weekend League, which is going to be my aim. I am 600 points away, and it's a Monday, so I have plenty of time. Thanks so much for watching the video, guys. If you did like it, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, comment below, share your friends, all that great stuff. Remember to vote on the poll to see do you think the icon is PC worth it or not. You can even put it in the comments. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Two rare player pack. Can we end it on a high? No, we can't. Can we get a board, please? No. Okay, we get Italian, Cam. Vasquez, we nearly got a board. We were run rating right away, but it's not a board, is it? We get Vasquez and Ainan. Thanks so much for watching, guys. And as always, I will see you next time. Hello.